everyone, welcome to Hedgehog Hollow. So today's hack is all about creating your own embellishments, trims. So whether you sew, whether you make cards, whether you do mixed media, this tip is for you and it's super fast. You're gonna love it because it saves a fortune. The other day I was in Joanne's, I wanted to buy some pom-pom trim for a project and I found this gorgeous rainbow trim, but it was crazy expensive. Whereas this white trim was super inexpensive. So I was like, well, I can create my own. And I'm gonna show you how to do that. So I'm just gonna cut a couple of these off. You can also do the same with something like this tassel trim. So you want anything that's kind of white cottony trim, which will work perfectly for you. So you can see how they look. And you can lay them out. Now you can use it on an easy clean mat, your glass mat, um, anything you really want. I'm working on a piece of wax paper because this makes a little bit of a mess and I like to just be able to toss it away and not have a load of clear up, but you can do whatever works for you. So you can do single colors. So say for instance, you wanted to do um, a green here. So what I'm gonna do is these are the Merry and Bright Aqua Flows from Tonic. Now you could use liquid watercolors, you can use um, something like these Aquaflows. These are great because you can see I can almost just paint on and when I want a lot of ink I can just squeeze and it will let me out as much ink as I want. So you can do kind of variegated ideas. You can also cheat and just take this off here. Whoops. And you can see, it wasn't what I intended to do because I've actually broken the seal that I didn't want to break, but um, the idea was I was going to put some on my surface like this and then just roll my pom-pom in it. And if you have any um, issues, so if it goes a little bit dry like that, you want to grab yourself a water spritzer, which I happen to have back here. And if you pre-dampen your piece, you'll find you get kind of different absorbency and you can see I actually get different effects from it. So that's super easy. And then I could do my next pom-pom in tomato juice. I think this one is, yeah, this one's tomato juice. So again, I can squeeze and squeeze or squeeze some out onto my surface and add some water to it. And I'm just gonna dip this in and then start moving it around. Not the best because it's gone a bit muddy with the two colors, but you can see how you could get a really fun rainbow effect on there. And then the same idea applies on this one here. So if you give this a squeeze, you can see how I can just paint on. And all of a sudden now I have green trim. So how cool is that? You could do it with your distress sprays, your distress ink pads. And if I spritz it first, I'm gonna get a different effect. So you're gonna see it lightens it up a lot. So you have a couple of different options on how you want to color it. And then you just run it through the trim. And you can do this with, as I say, any liquid watercolor, any pearlescent um, liquid watercolor. So your Brutus Monroe's, your Hero Art, your Tonics. Um, all of those things are gonna work really, really well for you. And I'm just adding some more color in here. So you can see it just changes that vibrancy. And then I would turn it over and do the same thing. But here I have that really cool ombre custom shade. There is also um, grenadine red in here. My hands might be a bit green by now. Probably should have done our reds first, but there we go. You can see, and the great thing is if you um, make it wet first, you see how much easier it runs. Um, so it just depends on the intensity and the effects you want to get. And you can daub some up on there as well. So you could create your own rainbow trims. You could use gloves if you wanted to, but this will just wash off because it's watercolor. Um, but it's super, super fun. It's a great technique. And of course, you're gonna save yourself a fortune on wrapping, on embellishments, because now you're just gonna buy white and create the color that matches your project perfectly. So hope you enjoyed this quick tip. I will see you again very soon. Don't forget to hit subscribe, ring the bell, and check out any coupons we have in the description below, including one on 15% off of Nouveau markers for the whole month of November. So you can check all that out in the description below and go save, go grab some, and I can't wait to see what you create. See you soon. Bye.